God bless you. Welcome to Pastor Kim's Corner. And guess who it is? It's me, Pastor Kim. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. That's my little intro. I'm going to try to work with that for those of y'all who know me. Um, if you don't know me, my name is Pastor Kim. I'm the pastor of Vision of Hope Ministries in North Carolina. Um, I do a morning motivation every day so that you can get the Word of God. And then um, I'm doing uh, my weight loss journey and keto diet and recipe. And uh, a couple other things. But come check me out. Uh, we have a lot of fun. Um, I have some daughters who have channels as well. But this is the most important part for me, and this is the part that I truly enjoy. I enjoy all of you too, but I really enjoy uh, giving that morning motivation, that word of the Lord, the biblical, the Bible. I enjoy giving the word of God because that's what's going to sustain us when all else fails, the word of God. So my scripture for today is Monday, May 18th, and my scripture for today is Proverbs, the 16th chapter, and the 32nd verse, and it reads, whoever is slow to anger is better than the mighty, and he who rules his spirit than he who takes a city. So again, Proverbs 6, Proverbs 16, 32, whoever is slow to anger is better than the mighty, and he who rules his spirit than he who takes a city. So whoever can rule their own spirit is better than someone who can take a city. So basically the Lord is um, letting us know that we have to learn how to control ourselves, our emotions, our anger, you know, um, whatever it is that we're feeling and sort of push any negativity away from us. We can't control other people, how they feel and what they do. But sometimes um, people will try to uh, create a different atmosphere for you or say something or do something that might try to bring you down. And so you have to be able to control your spirit, okay? You have to know who you are in Christ Jesus. And um, you have to not let people and their um, attitudes, negativity, Whatever, you know, they're having, you have to try your best not to let them bring you down. If you're positive, you stay positive, okay? You know, um, if you're on the upbeat, you, you know, you stay on the, you stay upbeat. Don't let anyone or any situation or anything bring you down. That's the gist of the word for the day. It's really making me think of uh, an additional word, but I'll give you that uh, tomorrow. So I hope you have a blessed day. Most of all, I hope you have the purpose filled life in Jesus' name. And don't forget our proverb today is Proverbs 16:32. Be in control of your spirit, people. Okay? God bless you. This is Pastor Kim. I hope you have a blessed day. Most of all, I hope you have a purpose filled life in Jesus' name. And you know that I love you with that agape love. Stay blessed.